mind because I have more. I always have stories. So I, I want to. Yes. Okay, but we're gonna. I'm gonna time this one. Now. Okay, <laughs> time, time it, time it. <laughs> no, for me, let me say I've been in the foreign service. I said um, it's like uh, I was born in the foreign service. I started growing in the foreign service. I grew up in the foreign service. I aged in the foreign service. <laughs> and I retired in the foreign service. It was all smooth, right? But then at the end, almost at the end of my career, that's when I had a tsunami fall on me. Oh. <laughs> This was, uh, I think everybody is experiencing what Donald Trump is doing mm -hmm. with uh, his team. You wake up, you find you are being fired on the tweet. Mm -hmm. So it was something <laughs> like that to me. <laughs> we had change of administration and then change of personnel. And then nobody told me it was uh, on New Year's Eve. And then I had my, uh, my father-in-law had, had passed away. So we had just finished the funeral. And then now I was just relaxing. I never heard that uh, we have a new team. The president has just announced. Mm. So if you are not announced, then mm. then you know. Yes. <laughs> so then I was in that grief. And then my husband, after the funeral, left. He went to Nairobi. And then while he was in Nairobi, that's when he heard the new team being announced. And they are not here among them. Mm. And then uh, he sends a message. To say, have you heard about this? I said, what? He said, you have no job. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> On New Year's Eve. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and, here now. and here I am. So let's, <laughs> thank you. Oh, wow. Thank you, Janella.